behind every head shaver, there's a story of why they shave their head. There's alopecia. There's people that shave their heads for performance reasons, you know, a basketball player. Then there's other people that do it for religious reasons. Uh, there's other people that do it because it's a result of hair loss. Everybody's reason is different, but we're that company that embodies everything about head shaving. My name's Todd Green, and I invented the head blade. A conventional razor takes your hand away from your head, so you can't shave by feel. Uh, and when you shave your head, there are certain places you can't see, so you have to shave by feel. Uh, and I had one of those eureka moments where I was just rubbing my head, um, and thought, man, if I could just put a razor on my finger, it'd be easier to shave. This is the first prototype I made. It's just clay. And I made it to look like a basketball because the first prototype was called the Hair Jordan. And the idea was you'd hold it in your hand like this and you'd shave. It was a good idea, but the design was terrible. This head blade is one that I actually used uh, every day for about a year. I hired somebody who makes movie props and he started making these prototypes. We actually included the wheels uh, to make it for a more intuitive uh, shave. A smoother shave. I like to say you replace the wheels every 15,000 miles or 15,000 head shaves, whichever comes first. The first day that I sold head blades, I, I made 500 head blades and I produced them locally in Los Angeles. And if you've ever been to Venice Beach, huge tourist area. I had five friends, had the girls on the roller blades, and I thought, I'm just gonna sell all 500 of them. This is the start of something great. Well, at the end of the day, we sold eight head blades. And I said to my ex-wife, I said, why am I doing this? I just spent a year of my life, $150,000, and we sold eight head blades. And she said to me, you gotta look at the bright side. You sold five. You sold more than everybody else combined. And I said, what am I gonna do with that? But when you realize that's what it is, it's you. If you have an idea and you're making the product, nobody's gonna care more than you do. Nobody has the vision that you do. And you have to have the perseverance. You're gonna be that one person in the room. And if you don't believe in yourself and you don't believe in what you're doing, that's when you should pack it up. The hair loss stuff, whether it's toupees or transplants or Rogaine or Propecia, that's a billion dollar industry. And what it does and has been, it's always looked at people who are going through hair loss as victims, you know? And so it's all these passive ways to either cover up hair loss or to get a transplant or to keep your hair. But none of them are about, hey, this is who I am. I'm gonna shave my head. And that's what Headblade embodies. And I'm proud of that. That's me.